Hi, this is Dr. Yoshi Ram with Oasis Family Medicine, and today's little video blog is on the Porter Ranch gas leak. Uh, I bring this up because both Dr. Quo and I have uh, patients who this is a real concern to. They live nearby. Now, is it a problem just for them? No, it's a problem for all of us. Uh, this has been called by some uh, the one of the biggest, I think the biggest natural or chemical disaster, I should say, in the United States since 2010, the BP, uh, the big BP spill. Uh, it's currently, if you look at images on thermography, basically thermal imaging of the area over Porter Ranch, you can see huge plumes of gas, right? Which to the naked eye is uh, invisible. However, people in the Porter Ranch area are complaining of a nausea respiratory system, uh, issues along with nosebleeds. Um, thousands have uh, had to relocate and so this is a real issue. We don't hear about it because it's not visible to the naked eye. Um, so what can we do about it, right? I'm gonna go with detox as best as possible. There's no one major thing that's known to uh, detox uh, um, toxic amounts of methane or mercaptans or God knows what else is in that gas leak. Um, so I'm going to go with general detoxification. Now, general detoxification, uh, what you want to do is you want to focus on the intestines. The intestines have to run properly before you can really think about detoxifying the liver um, because the liver dumps into the, into the intestines. And if the intestines are backed up, your toxins are just going to reabsorb right back into your body. So focus on the gut. Get regular bowel movements every day. Um, at least two bowel movements a day would be optimal. And do that however you can or however is needed. You know, lots of water, um, um, uh, fiber, uh, triphala can help as an herbal supplement. Um, also binding, binding agents like bentonite clay. They can bind the toxins in your intestines. Once you have your intestines working properly, then focus on the liver, right? Because that's where most of our detoxification happens in our system. It's the, it's the main filter of our, of our body. And things that you can do there um, from a food-based uh, source, it's really cruciferous veggies, watercress, um, onions, scallions. Those are really good things to help detoxify the liver. Um, other things that can help, uh, making sure your zinc is up to par. Uh, milk thistle is wonderful. Red clover is wonderful. Uh, curcumin, magnesium, the B vitamins, and then NAC or N-acetylcysteine and glutathione are also wonderful. A couple of products that help uh, that could be beneficial in case you don't want to go searching for all this. Designs for Health has something called LVGB and uh, Mediherbs has something called Livaplex. Um, those are wonderful things. Again, just focus on really your overall body detoxification, um, getting the lymphatic system moving on a consistent basis, best done through exercise. Um, and so this is Dr. Yoshi Ram. Just wanted to offer a couple of nice detoxification tips, uh, especially to those um, in the Porter Ranch area and surrounding areas. If you find this useful, feel free to pass it along. Thanks.